No, 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 no. This, this can't be happening. What can't be happening? I can't see the shoes. These are shoes, my naive nature-loving sister. Shoes. Hello? I am uh, drowning in tool up here. I think your expertise is needed a few feet higher. I have made my shoes. Flora, you look gorgeous. You don't think this dress is um, a little, a little much? Oh, honey, it is way, way too much. It's also exactly what you ordered eight months ago. Right, because Nana wanted it bigger and, and Papa wanted a higher neckline and my bridesmaids thought I should have more bling, so I guess I just forgot what I agreed to. Well, it kind of looks like you agreed to, um, well, all of it. I can negotiate the lowest delivery cost for the region's top winery and yet here I am, the executive wearing poof by popular vote. <laughs> well, you know, it's important that your gown is sensational to stand out from the crowd of cousins and cousins, cousins, cousins. I mean, Honestly, I don't even know half the people that Papa's invited. He sounds like a proud Papa. Proud. Stubborn. I mean, he is insisting that Aldo and I roll out all the Italian traditions, and I mean all of them. But I need two people just to go to the bathroom in this thing. You give us the signal, or the pros. Okay. Can you unzip me? Flora? <gasps> Aldo! You're not supposed to see me in my dress before the wedding! I thought you didn't like silly wedding traditions. Just wait till I tell Pepe. Don't you dare! I wouldn't dare. Some biscotti for you guys. Huh. The almond ones are amazing. Oh, is this a tradition? Ma quanto sei bella. How's it fitting? Better now that you're here, Amore. Dress, right? You didn't see it, did you? No. So on Wednesday, be sure to bring all of your accessories so we can see the whole look. Oh, I won't actually know what accessories I'm wearing until Friday night. It's tradition that the bride sits with the bridesmaids the night before the wedding to pick what jewelry she'll wear. I would uh, get those cousins to go easy on the bling. I'm just so grateful your mother was there at the first fitting. Otherwise, I don't know how big that dress would have ended up. No, our condolences. Marguerite had such a big heart, she could have been Italian. We lost Mama a few years ago, and without her, it's taken a while for my family to feel like celebrating again. Pepe and Nona already. They're excited. Yeah. A little too excited. Mom liked your family a lot. She even left a note saying that your father was a fun challenge. <laughs> mm. He's a very passionate man. Mm, yes, that is one way to look at it. Pepe, he's the best. Sure, he's the best with his future son-in-law, but with me, he's a crazy father of the bride. He's changing his mind constantly. I mean, we still haven't even locked the seating plan. Yeah, we'll, we'll get sorted. No worries, no worries. With the wedding five days away, we'll be sure to finalize everything tomorrow at the site meeting. And I've, um, I've committed to being a rep at the bridal show, so James and Hannah will make sure everything runs smoothly. Thank you. You're welcome. I, uh, I actually have a bunch of sewing to do tomorrow. Oh, mm. really? That's too bad, because it's at our family's winery. I'll be there. Yeah, he will. <laughs> All right. Andiamo, bello. Andiamo. <laughs> Ciao. Ciao. Thank you. Ciao. Ciao. I am so glad you are here. This place would not be the same without Clarkson Wedding Essentials. <laughs> Do you know that I think I actually met you for the first time at this very bridal show? <laughs> Your booth is looking a little supersized this year. Is it? Mm -hmm. Oh, well, you know. Even though we're growing, I still chose to remain by the bathrooms because everybody, everybody has, has to go, go eventually. <laughs> Take that and remember to sign up for our newsletter. Definitely. I love your designs. Oh, thank you. You see? The energy that you give out is the energy you get back. Your energy is exhausting, Mom. These shoes are killing me. I told you. Comfy shoes are the key to success. We need to update our website. Do you know any good computer people? Mom, I have to study. My homework's piling up, and I have these exams coming up soon. 
Please take a card. You're welcome. Okay, well, you should go home. Sally's going to be here any minute. Sally? The hairstylist? She's going to be our new coordinator. She has a lot of energy, too. She seems very creative. I think she'd be perfect. Hey! Sally! Hi, welcome to our booth. Yeah, by the restrooms? Yeah, well, it gets the most foot traffic. <laughs> Everyone's got to go eventually. Oh, 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 oh. oh, can I do? What can I do? This is my eldest, Paige. Oh, oh come on, bring it in, girl! Okay, <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank you. Oh, T minus 30. Here come the bride's time. Game on. Take a break when there's so much to do. Just maybe sit, take a rest. My soaps can wait. I got 800 cookies to bake. 800? Mm -hmm. There are only 400 guests coming. But my cookies are magic. They always seem to disappear. Nonna, you know, we could just buy Italian wedding cookies. You don't buy Nonna's cookies. Papa hired a caterer who specializes in traditional Italian. My Nonna made cookies for my mama's wedding. My mama made cookies for my wedding. I made cookies for your mama's wedding. Now I make cookies for my Flora's wedding. Okay. At least let me help. You don't make cookies for your own wedding. You stay right there. Not you not. can be the taster. <laughs> Only for my Flora. Mm, not bad, mm. huh? So good. Hi, sweetheart. There you guys are. Emma. I was just thinking, you know, it might be time that we take a little break. Who has time to take a break? Mama wants to make the candied almonds. What? You're going to make the almonds too? Not now. After. No, no. It's not the almonds you have to worry about. It's the cannoli that take time. No, it's too much. It's too much. You can never have too much in Nona's cannoli. <laughs> uh, we're off to clean the cellars. Why are you going to clean the cellars? The whole winery needs to sparkle. It's your wedding day. Ha. Huh. You've already planned so much, it's just... Stop it. Okay, uh, let me see. I've already planned the 12-course dinner uh -huh. before the sweet table and the uh, porchetta that comes at the end of the night. Uh, all the songs for the tarandella dances and uh, a lot of time for the garter toss. Uh... No, nope, I'm not doing the garter toss. What? Mm -mm. I've been practicing my snap and release. You and Nonna are already working so hard, so stop already, okay? We don't need to clean the wine cellars. Uh, first of all, give me this. Second of all, what do you think? I worked hard all my life for me. I did it for my family. And now I want to give my Flora everything in the world on her special day. I'll cheers to that, Papa. Huh? Are you calling him Papa? Yeah, so? He's like my son? Mama. <laughs> Look how strong and handsome this guy is. <laughs> well, maybe you should marry him then. <laughs> what? I'm just happy you're marrying a good man, that's all. Me too, me too. I just... Mm. Pa, you don't need to clean the wine cellars right now, okay? Clarkson's are coming over. Uh, you hired these wedding planners to help you begin the plan. But now we're so close, I'm okay with taking care of everything else. Maybe, but we're definitely gonna need them on the day. So, so that you can enjoy yourself. Please just let them do their jobs. Okay, I'll listen. You know what people like about me. I listen to what they say. <laughs> you hear, but do you listen to what they say, huh? You see? She's right. You're passionate. You should listen to Nana. Okay. Feels weird driving mom's car. You know, she taught me how to drive in this car. She just picked me up from the airport a couple of months ago in this car. Windows down. Classic girl rock pumping. <laughs> Shotgun! No, 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 no. Thank you. Fine. I will drive. Stick. <laughs> But I'm picking the music. We've gone through so much of her stuff already. I can't believe there's still boxes here. Well, I mean, we gotta get through it eventually. Maybe we could put some of it online. James, we can't just sell mom's stuff to complete strangers. She has grandkids that might want to use it one day. That is a long-term storage plan. Or dad. He doesn't want 
any of this stuff. He doesn't want anything to do with us, Hannah. It's just stuff. It's not just stuff. This is pieces of her. Sorting through all of her things properly is really helping me right now. I get it. dad for not coming out from LA yet. You were out of touch for months and nobody judged you. Okay, the difference is I knew I was being a jerk to this family and I'm here now, aren't I? What are you doing? Video calling dad. No, don't, please. I, I do not hey want to- Hey there, pumpkin. How are you? Hey dad, I'm good. I'm just here with James. Oh, Jimmy Jr. Wow, I thought you'd be back in New York by now. Ah, well, funny thing. When a matriarch dies, sometimes family needs to spend some time together. Well, you know I wanted to be there for all of you. Show couldn't change the shooting schedule. It's complicated here now. Your dad's in a big storyline. Yeah, Drake Drescher losing his fake empire. Well, us real-life plebs are trying to save Clark's wedding essentials. <laughs> we understand, Dad. It's just been really hard. When do you think you'll be able to get out here? We'll see, you know Jenna gets those terrible allergies anytime she leaves California. Who's Jenna? Oh, right, I, I meant to call. Uh, so, Roberta and I have run our course, and uh, Jenna's my new fiance. It's like a revolving door of girlfriends. Oh, and she would really like to meet you. She's just so busy writing, producing, directing, and starring in a one woman stage production. Ah, yes. Theater in Los Angeles, so important. Dad, we could really use some hugs right now. Oh, you know I'm sending them. Every day. Airmail. First class. Two minutes, Mr. Clarkson. All right. Well, kids, the camera's calling. Love you both. And uh, say hi to Paige and uh, her family. All right. The family? I doubt he even knows which granddaughter is which. Do you? <laughs> yeah. Sophie's the taller. Shorter? One. Hey! Hi! <laughs> Thank goodness you guys are here. Oh, I really need reinforcements. I have some great ideas I want to share with you. Great. Please come I on. have been running this family business with my heart for years, and I will do anything Hi. to protect them. Oh, it isn't our favorite TV dad. We see more of him on TV than we do in the flesh. <laughs> you cannot take away what's most precious to me. My children. Oh, he's so handsome. All right, time for coffee. Okay, Pa, yes. they are here to help us finalize the last details, so why don't you go get that list and we can see how it fits with things that I've been doing. Yeah, okay, about. okay. But well, first, I think we should take a little tour of the winery. That's all we just. Uh... Actually, I think first we should do the details and then take a tour. No, let's, let's take them on a tour. Well, they'll need to see where the dinner and the dancing will be set up. A tour would be smart. Come on, let's go, everybody. This way. Just run. Okay. It's for you. Okay. And this is where the sweet table is going to be, right over here. Here is where the band's going to play. What? I thought we agreed on a DJ. Uh, no, I got a guy. Don't worry about it. You're going to love his music. So when are the flowers landing? Uh, Saturday morning. Fiore d'Arange. Orange blossoms. Yeah. And uh, lemons for the centerpieces, because we're from the south. It's all lemons and oranges. So the tables and the rentals for 400 are also uh, Saturday morning? You know what? I better make it 438. You can't say no if they want to bring the kids. No, but we did say no uh, on the invitations. I, I guess I would just like something that is a little more me at this wedding. Bella, you are you. This whole family is you. What are you talking about? Pepe, Pepe. It's beautiful what you've done. I just think maybe we should incorporate a little more Flora just for some balance. What balance? I'm me. I'm my mother. I'm Flora's mother, Rosa. Rest her soul. And that's three votes right there. Please. I promised your mother I would take care of you for the rest of your life. Let me do this for you. What Pep is planned, it sounds pretty good. Ah, thank you, and that's four votes. Are you really taking his side? I'm, I'm not taking his side. Well, Flora, somehow in this crazy life, you and I found each other, okay? That's reason enough for a big celebration. And I'd invite everyone I'd ever met if I could. I'd wear whatever, I'd eat whatever, I'd do whatever because I get to marry you. 
You wouldn't have to wear my wedding dress. <laughs> no. Let's just give them this day. All these traditions Pepe wants, they bring our families together so we can start our own. That is definitely something I want us to plan for. <laughs> I can't wait for little Pepe. Okay, Pa, one thing uh, at a time. Yeah, okay. okay. Come on. Too. How's the show going? Oh, it's great. Oh, and your booth looks so great, too. Hey, I would love to get some shots of you. It could be really good coverage. Yeah, do, do you want to? Uh, yes, yes. Okay. Um, yeah, maybe right, right here? Yeah. Okay. Do we have any social media coverage planned? Great. Oh, your booth, I mean, it's so beautiful and tasteful. I think your mother would be very proud. I'm sorry. It's just been, it's been a lot. Okay. Mom looked forward to this all year and I've been dreading it all week. Oh, we have this huge Italian wedding and James and Hannah couldn't be here. I'm sorry. We're all here for you. Okay, anything you need. Mm -hmm. Oh, I should, I should get this. Uh, this wine is amazing. I had no idea you could just drink from the barrel. <laughs> I'm glad you liked it. You know, I can trace the history of these wines all the way back to Italy. Huh. Yeah. We're going to bottle a special vintage for Flora. Just see this. Eat! Eat! Ma it's going to go bad! Non na siediti, sit! Oh, wait a minute! Come on! Come on, come on! Wow. Thank you, fellow. Mama's the best cook, and her baking is just beautiful. <laughs> yeah. So on the list, there was the cake and the dessert table as well, and I think we have that all booked. Yeah, but I got a guy. My brother-in-law's nephew. It's all arranged. Whatever it is, Pa always has a guy. I'm too lovable to say no to. <laughs> Thank you, everybody, for coming. Here, let's raise a glass. Should yeah. we wait for Nona? No, she doesn't drink. Salute, salute. 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 Cheers. Salute. I love you. Yeah. Oh, no, what happened? No, no. On it. Mama doesn't need a specialist. She just fell down. She's old. It happens. I know that. I'm not even a doctor. Would you just let them do their jobs? Ah, just sit. And now what? We have to spend another four hours over here to find out that she just fell down. We gotta go back home. We gotta finish planning this wedding. No, we don't. All this wedding prep has put Nona in the hospital. What happened, it isn't anyone's fault. Huh? It's not worth it. Flora, you will remember this wedding day for the rest of your life. You know what I'll remember? If Nana's not there because she's exhausted from making 800 cookies that I don't even want. I didn't want this wedding to get so crazy big. Pepe, maybe we can rethink this. I mean, my family would understand. Yes. Yes, we could, we could do something simple and small. We'd still be getting married. That's all I want. It's too late. Everything is booked. Everyone's coming. It's happening on Saturday. Pa, you trust me to be the managing director of the winery. Why can't you just listen to me about my own wedding? I don't like hospitals. I spend enough time here with your mother. Sellers won't clean themselves. How's Flora and Aldo? Not awesome. Flora's dad still has a ton to do, and Flora's grandmother just got admitted to the hospital. Wait, are those two things related? Yeah, kind of. I, I don't know. But it sounds like she'll be fine. They just need to run a few tests. I'm sorry, I wish I'd been there. Is her dad at least being helpful? No, 
Paige, that's the thing. He's literally trying to take over the entire wedding. How's the bridal show? Any new clients? Uh, it's good, I think. I really don't know how to gauge it. But I'm running out of business cards, so that's a good sign, right? Honestly, I don't know what I'm doing. Listen, I think we're all feeling a little overwhelmed with this whole wedding planning business. Yeah. It's just weird being here with Aunt Mom. How did she manage to do all of this by herself? She was super mom. Yeah. Don't worry, James and I have everything under control with Flora and Aldo. I gotta go. I gotta fire Christopher. What? He's our best caterer. Hey, do you have a quick second? For you? Yeah, sure. Hey, do you want a coffee? Yes, please. Cookie? Do I ever turn down food? Hey. Come on. A woman likes to eat after my own heart. Thanks. So, you're, you're pretty busy today, huh? Mmm, yeah. It's not just the cafe, it's the catering side, too. Weddings over the weekend, bridal shower over the week. Okay, then I actually might have some really good news for you. I have to cancel Saturday's order. Uh, you've hired another baker to replace me. No, no, this family's just really big and they're hiring somebody through their own connections. Okay, well, as long as it's not, you know, personal. No, it's not personal between us and there's... Sugar? Huh? Yes. Uh, do they put sugar in espresso in Italy? Good espresso doesn't need sugar. That's a really strong espresso. That is a good espresso. Okay, well, I came here to fire you, and I did, so I'm, I'm gonna go. That's mine. That. That is exactly how I want my wedding day to look. That's perfect, Ella. We're totally on the same page. We will talk soon. Until mm -hmm. then, have fun out there and insider scoop. Bride's Bubbles down there is having a rosé toast at three. Don't miss it. <laughs> Thank you. My, my, my. Look at you. Homie and understated. Marguerite always knew the trends ahead of the curve. She did. So then what's wrong? It's working. I, I just, I don't know if I can handle this on my own. It's, it's really busy. You'll be fine. We'll just continue building from your mother's foundation. You know what? You're right. I can do this. Yeah. Do you know how you can really tell that you're doing well? Uh... Do your feet hurt? What? You know that you're doing a good job when your feet hurt. Hi, do you do party limos? Well, party actually... limos? Oh, girl. I can get you a party bus. Oh, how are you? Oh, I'm fine. Oh, well, silly doctors, they worry too much. What? Bella, what? I was worried about you, no? Oh. And Papa's being impossible. Well, he always is. Yeah. Aldo, though, how's he? He's amazing. Mm -mm. He's a good boy. Mm -hmm. But don't lose your voice, ever. You come from a long line of strong women. Speak up. I love you. Oh, me too. We'll be right out. OK, stop. You're making me dizzy. I knew we should have never let Zia Maria make the bridesmaids' dresses. What? You're jumping to conclusions. We haven't even seen them yet. How's it going in there? See? They hate them. They haven't even said a word. Silence is way worse. They, they can't be that bad. 
Hey, hey, why don't you come on out, ladies? Let's do a fashion show. Well, um, your Aunt Maria certainly has her taste. Don't worry, Flora. It's fine. Really. Yeah, with, with jewelry and heels, we'll look good. Mean it. Well, it would have looked great on me, but it didn't even fit. Thanks, ladies. But you can go take those off. I can't put my girls through this. They look like they're going to an 80s prom, not my wedding. I want them to look like themselves, strong, sexy, fierce women. Yeah, well, not to get in the middle of like family politics, but uh, you know, I could start from scratch, give them something oh. a little more elegant, up to date. This is crazy. We've had months of planning and yet here we are just scrambling at the last minute. I knew I should have said something sooner. Now there's just more stress for everyone. Here's the thing, I, I work great under pressure. Kind of my thing. Yeah. No, it's it's too much. I it's enough. Oh. Hey. So Pepe just called. He wants to switch the prosciutto slicing station to lamb. Is that okay? Huh. Silence is worse. <gasps> I can't do this. This is supposed to be the happiest day of my life, and I feel like I'm being suffocated by my own way. Hey, hey. Just take a breath. It's not too late. Tell me what you want. We'll make it happen. I want to look. What? what? Guys, this better be an emergency. I've been up on my feet all day, and I told Dan that I wouldn't miss another family dinner. Paige, we have 438 guests due to arrive at the winery in 48 hours, and we might not have a bride and groom. Oh, oh okay, yeah, that is best signal worthy. What, what is going on? Remember when eloping used to be romantic, like Romeo and Juliet? Paige, the whole wedding's a disaster. Well, so is the end of Romeo and Juliet. Floor and Aldo want to elope? At City Hall. When did that happen? It was always supposed to be a traditional Italian wedding, and, and, and... Flora was gonna put her own spin on it. She was just never given the chance. Yeah, I think mom was gonna help her with that. You guys, we really dropped the ball on this one. I think we just listened to the loudest voice. Guys, Aldo and Flora are the ones who hired mom. They're the clients. We're supposed to be supporting them and what's best for them. Except, I don't think Flora wants to elope. What about the I want to elope part? I think she's just mad at her dad, something I know a little bit about. But I don't think Aldo wants to elope. I think he's just doing it to appease Flora. But our job is to give them the wedding they want. If they want to elope, that's okay. We'll be there for them. But we'll keep planning the wedding, just in case there's another change of heart. Hmm. Let's inject some more Flora back into this wedding. We go destroy those bridesmaids' dresses. There is nothing salvageable. And I will call Dan. Oh, and maybe order some takeout. Pizza? I know that things can get a little awkward between us now that you and I are vying for the same business, but I want you to know that I am really rooting for you, Hannah and James. Your mother and I always found a way to remain on good terms. Well, that's not entirely true. We should be giving them a modern wedding, not some version of their parents' wedding. Okay, Clarkson keeps it simple. The couple comes first, we work around what they want. And I get that. And that may have worked in the past, but how about we give them something that works in the future? I care about this company too, Marguerite. I know you care. Then I should be a partner. I graduated top of my class in business school. 
I'll consider it. Marguerite, I love you, and I respect you. You gave me my first start, but I'm being undervalued. I am not in a position to do this right now. Also, I have my kids to think about. Your kids? James is in New York, as far away from here as he can be. Hannah is in the jungle somewhere taking photographs, also as far away from here as she can be. Paige is here. She's just not here. My kids are exactly where they need to be. Don't you ever undervalue them. You may not have agreed with my mother to keep the business entirely in the family, but I am grateful to her right now. I have something real to hold on to. Something that I can help grow and keep her memory alive. And I get that. And I respect what you're doing with her legacy. I just want to make sure that you and I maintain our friendship. Here, for your sore feet. Are you kidding? I love them. Oh my gosh. I love them. I love them. Thank you. <laughs> Go home and rest. Let's get out of here. I am done. Oh, me too. I am putting these on the nanosecond I get home. <laughs> We got your text. Is everything okay? You two change your minds? Uh, well, we need two witnesses. So you're going through with it. As long as we get married, trust me, we're happy wherever we are. Well, we are in the business of happy couples, and you two look happy. Well, we are. The justice of the peace is just running a little bit behind. Hey, how's Nona doing? Much better. Thank you. She should be back on her feet soon. It's wonderful. Yeah. <laughs> you think they'll let us play our own music? I I don't know if they'll be able to do personal touches. There might not be time. Number 26? Huh. Yeah, that's us. Are you sure you're okay with this? Yeah. Well, let's get you two eloped, huh? This is happily ever after, like instant soup. So you got your paperwork? Yeah. Yeah. All right, everything seems to be in order. All right, folks, please rise. Will the couple repeat after me? I don't want to. <laughs> Flora? That's... This is a mistake. We need our families and our friends and a room that doesn't smell like instant soup. The best smell in the whole world is Nona's cookies. And that's the smell that I want to remember when I think about our wedding day. We haven't told anyone yet or, or canceled anything. So you want to go back to the big wedding? I do. for you, too. Ah, no, no, no. I'm done. I should have been done a long time ago. I had a talk with Aldo today. He told me what the two of you almost did. I'm so sorry. No, I'm sorry. Sometimes I'm too stubborn to listen to you. Pretty much all the time. Okay, all the time. <laughs> but that's how much I love you. I just wish your mother was here to see what a strong, beautiful woman you'll become. I miss her. I can still close my eyes, and I see her on our wedding day. Rosa was the most beautiful girl in the world. 
That was the happiest day of my life. And I just wanted the same for you. That's for you. Mom's jewelry from Italy. Yeah. I was her mother's before that. It's beautiful. Maybe one day it'll be your daughter's. You really see a lot of kids in my future, huh? Serenata. That's not me. I had nothing to do. <laughs> Miracle worker. Yeah, a hundred <laughs> times better. Well, call me Mr. Miracle. Remember, smile, chins up, poise, and it's step together, pause, step together, pause, step. Like a kiss, I just had to stare. We 
wheels of the train roll away Through the glass you wink and you wave Now my heart will be looking away And I'll find you Thank you for letting us be a part of your family story. Special. Okay, Nonna's gonna give you the bonbon yet, okay? <laughs> Ciao. Ciao. Bonbon. Oh, thank you. That's so sweet. Thank you. Your kids are lucky you had a good mother. I bet. She made you nice, strong people. And that's all. This is for you. Oh, wow. It's a little something from my family to yours. It's not. That's so sweet. Thank you. I know I drove you guys a little bit crazy. <laughs> I'm sorry. No, just, just a little bit. <laughs> no, in, in a fatherly kind of way. <laughs> Thank you again. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank Good you. Night. Is that a father showing some form of self-awareness? Quick, you should video chat Dad and we'll tell him all about it. <sighs> Come on, guys. Let's get out of here. This mommy needs to get home. All right. You guys got wine? We did. We did all the work. Mm. 